External storage devices come in many sizes and forms. External storage allows you to store files from your computer on a storage device that is outside of your computer. The most common external storage device is a flash drive or thumb drive. These are small, low-priced devices that allow you to store files on them. You can then move the flash drive to another computer and copy the files over or save more to it. Flash drives have no internal moving parts, which make them extremely reliable and durable. These devices will come anywhere from 4 to 64 gigabytes in size. If you are looking for more storage space, but you still want to be portable, look for an external portable hard drive. These devices use a small 2.5 inch laptop hard drive that is surrounded with a plastic case. It will then use a USB cable to plug into the computer, which will both power the device and transfer the data. It is important to remember that some USB ports on computers do not provide power, so the device will not work on those ports. Also remember that external hard drives have moving parts inside them, so you want to be more gentle when handling them. External hard drives can be found in sizes anywhere from 320 gigabytes to 1.5 terabytes in size. If you still need more storage size, you can purchase a non-portable external hard drive, which uses a 3.5 inch desktop hard drive inside. These devices will need to be plugged into an additional power source in order to use them. There are other types of external storage, such as NAS devices, which stands for Network Attached Storage. This can be as simple as an external hard drive with an Ethernet port on it. The device is then plugged into the back of a router, which enables all of the computers that are connected to the router to access the device. This makes file sharing between computers on the same network very easy. It is also nice for backing up multiple computers onto one storage device without unplugging cables. NAS devices come in many sizes, and give you the ability to access a large amount of storage space on your network. We will show you how to install and use these devices on the chapter on backing up and transferring data.